Hello dear friends, welcome back to your favorite channel where we bring you trending and interesting news from around the world. May I quickly crave your indulgence to please subscribe to this channel. Please hit the bell icon so you can get notification whenever we post new stories. Also, kindly share these new stories with your friends, family, relations and loved ones so they can get to know what is happening around the world and be informed. Thank you so much guys, I appreciate your support. What is left of APC is just respect for Buhari Rochas Okrocha says. A founding member of the All Progressive Congress APC and former governor of Imo State, Rochas Okrocha has said that only respect for President Muhammad Buhari is all that is left of the APC and that the crisis rocking the party was part of consequences for relegating the founding members. Rocha Sokorocha, who addressed some journalists on Sunday in Abuja, said that there is no more APC. According to him, the party that is smarting from internal crisis after or suffering from internal crisis after the 2019 general e elections died the day the leadership abandoned the progressive and democratic ideals on which it was founded. Okorocha, who is also the senator representing Imo West Senatorial District, said that apart from President Buhari, the other leaders of the political blocs that merged to form the party in 2015 were practically skimmed out by forces that later joined their party. Permit me to give you the inside of APC. This word, APC, was formed by four major political parties that had governors. One was the CPC, led by President Muhammad Buhari. SCN, led by Ahmed Bola Tinubu. ANPP, led by Obonaya Ono, who all brought their structures. Abga, led by me, brought in a structure. Every other person fell into this structure. The PDP group that came in and joined us, I gave the name APC. I designed that logo and that was the beginning of the party and we had an understanding. That is the party you call APC. And unless we go back to where it all started, APC can never see the light of the day. And that was how we started. And that was what brought President Muhammad Buhari to office. You cannot rule out the role of those four key people. Then, CPC has only one governor in Nasarawa. Abga had only one governor. SEN came with the chunk of the governors and ANPP had a few. And we shared the first positions equally among these four parties. Now, the founding fathers of the, part, of the party are relegated to the backgrounds and people are coming with different interests, making us play the same kind of politics that PDP played, Okorocha said. He added, there is no more APC. What we have is the respect for President Muhammad Buhari. That is what is keeping us together. What we have is our respect for the person of President Buhari. And we still believe that something can be done. That trust and respect is what we still call APC. Outside that, Respect for President Buhari and the trust and belief that he could wake up one day and correct all this injustice and make it fine. That is the only thing that is keeping the APC. If not that, I don't think there is anything like APC. Because people are beginning to get fed up. Again, PDP is not even better. The party has its own challenges. 
All right, guys, what are your thoughts concerning what um, Richard Sukurucha has said concerning um, the APC? Well, take it or leave it. The PDP, as it is right now, has better uh, structures than the APC, and people prefer the PDP to the APC. It is sad and unfortunate. It is the truth. So, regardless of what people feel or think or say, regardless of what Okorocha says, APC being uh, or coming together and uh, no longer existing is only the handiwork and the, the, the downfall is as a result of the people in the party. Not just the people in the party, but also the president himself who has, who has filled the nation, filled the people of Nigeria woefully. So it is what it is. Whose fault and who is to blame if there is nothing left of APC? Then it is what it is. If nothing is being done, well, we keep our fingers crossed and watch how things unfold in 2023. There probably might be no APC in the next election in 2023. I stand to be corrected. But let's take a few reactions and let's see what people are saying concerning these news stories as it were. APC can only come alive again if Barack Hussein and Obama came back to the White House again. We all know what played out. Evil can never last long. Okay. Yemi T says, Senator Okorocha, I am sorry, but I think that you are still being silly with hypocrisy. Your real problem is that you make Buhari an incompetent, bigoted, clannish, narrow-minded, and dishonest man who has demonstrated times and again that he is incapable of taking charge when given responsibility, the core of your party. He is the problem and can't rise to the occasion to become the solution. His usefulness is to the extent that he helped you win elections due to his popularity in the North. He can't give more, which is why your party will die with his tenure. Okay, guys, do you agree with this uh, opinion? Well, we keep our fingers crossed and see how things unfold. Another person says, Buhari is your problem. He does not hear words. When he is counseled, or when he is counseled against anti people's policy, unless you get rid of him, if not, forget any resolution. It won't work. Mark my words. Okay. It is obvious that the choice of Buhari is the biggest mistake APC has made. Look at the nation since 2015. The anti-people's policies of Buhari has killed the party. With the look of things, APC may go into complete extinction on or before 2023. Guys, do you agree? Well, it is what it is. Vincent Ebule Uchenna says, This old man again, he will soon start begging as usual when they come for him. Selfish man. David says, the bunch of frustrated broom will soon fall and scatter Yakata. Buhari is the problem of APC entirely. So APC is dead and buried. Guys, do you agree with this opinion? Well, it is what it is. It remains to be seen. Charles Welbeck says, Buhari is sure the problem of the APC. He's, he is self-centered lopsided okay his self-centered lopsided appointment non-interest in the success of party contestants costs of running government and recent policies are what killed the apc guys do you agree with this opinion to a very large extent i think this opinion is correct i stand to be corrected if i am wrong another person says lpc has no structure no foundation so can so can never stand the test of time a party hurriedly set up out of hatred for president good luck jonathan will surely crumble it is what it is guys this said victor chinedu says if buhari is your problem call for his impeachment after all you are a senator pmb2 has been overwhelmed and he is just waiting for the end of his second term god will soon or show that he can conveniently retire from 
God willing, so that he can conveniently retire from active politics, as age two is not on his side. Well, it is what it is. If he can retire now, today, so that the competent hand can take over, I think it will be to the um, good news of the people. Well, it is what it is, guys. What are your thoughts? Kindly drop by at the comment section. Let's know what your thoughts are on this particular news story. Drop by at the comment section. Let's know what your thoughts are. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Hit the bell icon so you can get notification whenever we post new stories. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate your support, and I'll see you on the other news. Thank you and bye for now.